what is good YouTube before I get into this video I just wanted to say that if you enjoy talking about basketball anything from high school to college to NBA consider hitting that like and subscribe button just want to have a good discussion with you guys hear what you guys have to say I'll be responding to every comment on this video uh, so like I said consider hitting that like and subscribe button and let's get into it so where is Julian Newman now in 2021? If you clicked on this video, you probably know the Julian Newman story. You've probably seen too much Julian Newman, uh, but for some reason, like a lot of people, still end up clicking on the videos no matter how much you hate the guy. Uh, so like I said, you probably know the story after high school, claimed to have, you know, like 10 plus D1 offers, uh, was talking with, you know, big time programs like Florida and Kansas and all these high majors um, ended up getting 10 plus D1 offers um, but decided to turn all those down instead to go the pro route uh, and then same story here uh, with the pro route claimed to have offers to play pro ball in all the big countries like Australia and the NBL like Lamella Ball uh, China to be I guess the next Chinese sensation overseas there or I think it was like Spain uh, playing one of the top leagues there uh, but so far in 2021 uh, it doesn't look like he's accepted any of these offers so why did Julian never accept one of his NCAA offers uh, that's a good question I'm, I'm not really sure why I know a lot of people will say that his offers were never real uh, which you know has a lot of proof that they were never real because none of the major recruiting websites uh, ever really reported them. I know his first offer from UTS, UTSA, uh, that did gain some traction online. I think it was actually reported uh, that he did have that offer. But after that, none of the nine plus offers ever really got reported on. So I'm, you know, assuming all those offers were made up, they never were you know real uh, and so I think that's why the college route was out he thought he was better than UTSA uh, playing in I think the conference USA and so Julian Newman I guess is above that level uh, and so he decided to go the pro route so here we are now at the start of 2021 and Julian Newman's not in college and he's still not playing pro ball uh, why isn't he playing pro ball well, I guess if you probably asked him, he'd say something along the lines of it has to do with coronavirus uh, and no teams are bringing in players uh, for that. Uh, I guess maybe the leagues that he was talking to, they're not. I know, you know, several players that have gone overseas during this time, you know, and are playing pro ball overseas. Uh, and so I guess some leagues it's not. Some leagues coronavirus is affecting uh, and I guess all the countries that Julian was going to go to, uh, it has affected him. Or it has affected his offers. Or maybe none of those offers were actually real. Uh, and he's making those up too. So what exactly is Julian Newman doing right now? I'm not really sure. According to his Instagram, it looks like he's in California. Training for, I guess, probably the 2021 NBA Draft. Uh, if you can believe that uh, but I, I guess if you stay tuned to the channel and when we do you know a lot of our draft stuff that we uh, plan on doing I don't think he's gonna make the mock draft so uh, yeah uh, those are just kind of you know what I've seen from Julian Newman he's gone from you know high school internet legend to now you know struggling to you know find a place where he fits in the basketball community because He's not playing college ball. I doubt he ever gets a serious look at pro ball. Uh, and so I'm not sure what his next move is. Is it to do something like, you know, the Harlem Globetrotters? Is it to become just, you know, an online personality? Something for like Overtime or Ball is Life or one of those sites? I'm not sure. Uh, but leave your thoughts down in the comment section below. Uh, what do you think Julian Newman should do? What should be his best move or his next move? Uh, in terms of his basketball career, I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. Uh, leave your thoughts in that comment section down below, uh, and I'll talk to you guys later.